All right, hey YouTube, it's AST Razor 64 back again with another video game collectible unboxing, and this time it is for the Deluxe Collector's Edition for Battlefield One, as it says there. Um, it is by Triforce. Apparently, it's the same as the Mirror's Edge. The game is separate from the collectors. I did not know that until I saw when they delivered it today. They just dropped it off. Um, I could, I could not, because this is Amazon exclusive, so I had to wait for it to be delivered. Um, some places might sell it, but as far as I know, it's Amazon exclusive. So anyways, um, let's get on with this unboxing. It's very massive, as was the Mirror's Edge. So I guess EA, EA is doing this now whenever they have a collector's. I mean, I'm not sure, but uh, let's go ahead and get on with it. I did open the box already. Um, the game was not sitting on top, but you do get the early and less deluxe edition. And we'll, we'll open it last as always. And um, the game is separate, as was the Mirror's Edge. So I'm going to be setting the game to the side. And that's when you get on with it, man. Freaking massive. I did not expect it to be this way. But like I said, any, any future collectibles from EA are probably going to be this way. So, okay, so here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Right. Let's set that bad boy to the side. And we'll be setting the, 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 the outer box to the side. And there's nothing else in the outer box. So here it is guys, Battlefield 1, DICE, uh, EA of course, there is, I guess one of the main characters from the campaign, I'm not quite sure, uh, he is British as far as I know, and of course it is World War 1 base. So we had beta was good, um, me personally, I'm into the campaign, so I will be definitely playing that, that's what it's multi, but let's go ahead and get on with it. Yeah, it does have instructions how to unbox the... The figure just like Mirror's Edge did, so. All right, Zay, go ahead. All right, this thing's freaking massive. Battlefield 1 on top, there you go. Here's the front, here's the main, I guess, like I said, a Battlefield 1 dice. This is beautiful outer collector box. There's the side there. Here is the side here. The space statue with the desired weapon combination. Oh, I guess the weapons are interchangeable. Not really like an action figure, but, um. We will find the battery compartment is located on the bottom. Oh, I guess it does rotate. I guess I'll make a separate video about that. Even though I will try turning it off and on this time. See if it still comes with the pre-batteries installed. So, I guess I can see it rotates from the base or whatnot. But you can either equip it with a shotgun, some kind of mace, um, pistols, whatnot. So, let's go ahead. Here is the bat. Dice. Triforce. Comes with a 14-inch collectible edition statue. Him. Uh, the deck of playing cards. A messenger pigeon with ex exclusive DLC content inside. Uh, a patch. Uh, like I said, a beautiful collector box. A uh, cloth propaganda poster and a beautiful steelbook. The steelbook is, hopefully that's what it looks like. It's different from the uh, pre-order. I know GameStop has to where if you bought the premium, you get a steelbook. But um, th that's, it was different looking from this steelbook right here, I believe. That we'll find out when we open it. So anyway, that's, without further ado, here it goes. We'll be setting the beautiful slip cover to the side. There you go. Plain black outer box, as was the Mirror's Edge, but there's Battlefield kind of engraved. It's textured. Uh, Battlefield 1 there. There's nothing on the bottom. No point of showing that or the size either because it's plain black. Oh, all right. Son of a bitch is massive. So, okay, here we go. Oh, well, this. Okay, this is where this. That's still book, I guess. Anyway, let's go ahead and. It on. Oh, okay, it folds out like that. Cool. That's what you will be seeing. I guess it kind of, that kind of helps you. I don't know. So, anywho, that's what you're going to see when you first open it up. Let's go ahead and take this motherfucker. Oh, no, there's it. There it is. Oh, it's busy. Oh. Oh. Motherfucker. Motherfucker. Mm. All right. Okay. Anything else in the, in the outer box? Nothing in the beautiful collectible. Outer box, so let's go. And, no secret compartments. No, let's go ahead and set that to the not necessarily to the side, but to the side of the table. So everything is included in here. Beautiful box. Battlefield One is textured. Classic styrofoam as redemption process. Battlefield One probably has a code on there. I'm not going to be showing this. Let's go ahead and take this off. Set this to the side. So here we go.
very well packaged. Man. Oh, nice. Okay. So, take this bad boy out of there. Statue is massive, and that is again, she said. So, that's what you're going to see when you open it up. Everything is included in here. Here's a beautiful figure there. Let's go ahead and take a look. Nice. It, the weapons are interchangeable. Probably won't be doing that for the video. Might take too long. Um, beautiful, humongous figure, man. Oh my god. Triforce. Uh, beautiful, beautiful, well detailed. There it goes right there. Uh, like I said, the, web, the, the arms are, uh, forearms are removable or whatnot, I guess. And the uh, on and off switch. I don't know what it does. So I'm gonna make a separate video about that, but the batteries are right there. And we can maybe see that if we can find it. Go ahead and put that to the side for now. Figure, and this is what else you're gonna see. Let's go ahead and see what we have here. Set that to the side. Um, here's your playing cards. Battlefield 1. I probably won't be opening the cards, but Battlefield 1 there. Here's the passenger pigeon tube. Well, now we'll open that. See what we do have in here. Propaganda cloth. Here is the patch. Beautiful patch there, like a jockey or whatnot. So I don't know the significance of that. Yeah, I know what you do. You, you are able to ride horses on this one, but um, here it is, propaganda. Nice. And this now, your country needs you. This may be British propaganda. I'm not quite sure. Uh, definitely the soldier there. It's pretty cool. Probably going to set that over the box. Cool. Okay. Pastor Pigeon Tube. Yeah, the deck of cards I won't be opening. Um, cool little tube. Little pigeon Messenger Tube. Whatnot. Pigeon Messenger Tube or whatnot. But, um. Cool. Like I said, there's some DLC stuff in there. I probably won't be taking this bad boy out. But you do see the, uh what it does do this purpose is some kind of DLC and that's what it says set that to the side um, the interchange interchangeable interchangeable nice shotgun oh that's sweet huge interchangeable pistol how many minutes are we up to Seven. nice plenty of time Eight minutes, no. all right cool uh, interchangeable forearms like I said you can either have it with this shotgun or his Mace and I guess like a German style pistol or whatever that is. Sweet. Pretty action figure ish. 1911 there. So might be even switching them out. Like I said, go ahead and show him show how he looks before this change of weapons. This is, he has the this here and his other forearm there. Has this, and I guess you can switch them out. Nice. And this one's gonna be holding a shotgun. Thanks. Nice. So now th that's him with the shotgun and and uh 1911. Sweet, very well detailed, beautiful. Okay, yeah, the still book is different than the GameStop exclusive still book. Uh, there he is there, and I will be displaying the game in the still book as I always do. Battlefield one, the main character there. Here's the back. Um, the, the GameStop still book is beautiful too. Don't get me wrong. You know me. I love my still books. So we set that still book to the side and get on with it. Um, here's the batteries. The batteries are not pre-installed. I'm, I'm not too sure what that does. I will make a separate video about that because we probably don't have time. Kind of have a screwdriver handy or whatnot. The batteries that came inside, and I guess I couldn't even find the on-off switch for it. But the batteries go down there. Um, I don't have time to unscrew it and all that. I'll make a separate video like I said. I'm not too sure what it does. It may light up or it definitely doesn't rotate because there's no kind of base. But there you have it, guys. This is what you get. And we're just going to open the game. And there's nothing else in there. That's the passenger pigeon tube right there. So we're going to be setting this outer styrofoam to the side. And we're going to begin on with this game. Like I said, I went to them and I released just to pick up an earlier listed uh, deluxe edition for my nephew but because my came today i could not attend it and i couldn't go to the amazon warehouse or whatnot or wherever deck cards like i said i will not be opening them um like i said you get the uh early enlist or deluxe edition 
I believe this is this is the deluxe collectors Amazon exclusive. I believe they had a, a one a little cheaper that didn't come probably with the early industry. Probably didn't come with the game. So um, I do I definitely got the bigger one. And again, that is what she says. You can smell nice and new. You can smell the the paint. Open the game last as we always do it. The game is rattled in there. I mean, it was kind of sucks. So it's not damaged. And even if it is, oh well. I will be displaying the disc and the beautiful still. But anyways, let's go and display him in the middle. This is freaking awesome. Very well detailed. Triforce did an excellent job. So here we go, guys. Um, and the disc, like I said, I'm going to be display, dis displaying it in the steel book. Uh, Battlefield 4 standard PS4 disc, but it did come with a steel book. Uh, you did uh, you get uh, extra DLCs. I don't have, believe it did not come with a premium. But what it does come with was um, like the Battlefield Hardline different packs. It comes with the Hellfighter pack, Red Baron pack, Lawrence of Arabia pack, Beto Behemoth skins, and three battle packs. So. Uh, it captures everything I love about Battlefield. So, Epic 64 player multiplayer, war story from around the world. So, like I said, can't get on what a minimum gig is, uh, 40 gig minimum for now. So, um, like I said, you want to pick up premium, get a steel book from uh, GameStop. My buddy Ruben gave me a steel book, but I gave it to my nephew because I know I was getting my own. So, I'm not going to be showing the codes. So, like I said, guys, uh, there you go. This was an Amazon exclusive, like I said. Uh, maybe in the future, uh, retailers might have it other than Amazon. So, Get the cards, get the nice propaganda thing, cloth, get the beautiful, beautiful steel book, interchangeable weapons for the figure, nice, beautiful figure. You get a war patch, um, I don't know the significance, this is a jockey on there, some, and some other DLC uh, content that's inside the Pasture Pigeon 2, which is in the Star Phone. So, um, there you have it, guys. Um, until next time, let me hold on, and we're. I believe my next unboxing is going to be for the Dragon Ball Xenoverse 2 collectors, followed by the. That's another Amazon exclusive. It is for the um, Titanfall 2. It is a Series 2 Vanguard edition uh, where it comes with a, uh, a helmet as opposed to the GameStop exclusive. So um, it, it will be like the bigger collectors and other, other others uh, towards the end of the year. So uh, until then, guys, like us, uh, AST Razor 64, and we are signing off.